uh, fix some common problems and common issues with the generator. So we're going to start the generator just like if it was normally just sitting. So you're going to where the stop button is, you're going to push and hold the stop button and wait for the red light. Once you see the red light, it's 1 1000, 2 1000, 3 1000. Let off. Most common problems with RVs of not having power inside while if the generator is running. One, make sure this is plugged in unless you were plugged into shore power. Second, there's a little switch right here that's on the side which is your breaker switch. Make sure that this switch that is right here is flipped forward. If it is under a heavy load, this switch will trip to protect the generator. This is the most common problems while having no power inside. Last problem or last issue of not having power inside. Okay, other common problem is your main breaker was tripped. Simply reset. Main air conditioning microwave and auxiliaries. A lot of times you'll see it not tripped where it doesn't look like any of them are tripped what they'll do is they'll do a partial trip. Simply flip these all over and reset them. In other circumstances, if the generator is not running properly, depending on what your altitude level is, this is what I want you to do. You're going to simply, while the generator is not running, depending on what your altitude is, you can adjust this accordingly. There is marks on the side of the, on the, side of the carburetor bowl that will help you adjust this. It will take a couple of times for you to adjust it because it has to run fuel through here and into the carburetor.